Hello, hello everybody! Welcome once again to Mass Effect Legendary Edition. We are here with Goog Shepard, and I think, you know, we, we've been going with the, with the NXT 2.0 armor for a little bit now, but I think it might be time for a new look, and I'm feeling, I, I, I'm feeling kind of festive. I don't know. I I, I think maybe you know it, it's Christmas time. Maybe some some green with red. I don't know. Let's see how that looks. Let's go with this, and we'll we'll do a little a uh, little Christmassy shepherd. Sure. Why not? Let's get red lights going. We'll we'll, we'll deck the halls with the blood of our enemies, or something. I don't know. This is Commander Shepard now. <laughs> So last time we investigated the Project Leviathan on the Citadel, it took us to the Aesher system where we discovered a whole bunch of stuff, a weird colony of people who think it's 10 years ago because they've been under the thrall of this Leviathan thing? Creature? Question mark? Machine? Reaper? Who the hell knows? But, uh... We were here, we found Dr. Garneau, and then we blew him up, or rather, he blew himself up, but th don't worry, there there was blowing up, and there will probably be more blow-ups as, as we head back to the Citadel. 15 minutes into the stream, and I have the first thing that I know is going to be on YouTube. <laughs> We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. This is gonna go fine. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? How do you know you Perhaps were? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. Also, how do you know that you weren't? I'd call it dangerous as hell. Ryson's assistant tried to kill me. Mm-hmm. Perhaps Leviathan was controlling him to protect itself, diverting people away from its trail. Maybe. It just shows we don't know what we're dealing with yet. It's true. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. Stayed here all night, fell asleep at my desk. Conclusion, definitely inert and safe. We should all be near it. Maybe more useful than Leviathan. <laughs> oh, fuck. They were testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Anything interesting about the artifact's structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing relevant. Alright, what about the, uh, strange husk head? Useful. Aha! A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. I'm at the dig site in the Pylos Nebula. Project Scarra paid off. I've got another artifact like the one Garneau found. I think it could be affecting people's behavior. Mm -hmm. You need to shield the one in your office. I tried to warn Garneau, but I can't get through. We've got Reaper scouts coming in toward the main site. I'm heading to the secondary base to grab what research I can. Anne Bryson was attempting to contact Garneau on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something about the artifact. Well, given that she said she knows something about the artifact, it's a reasonable conclusion there, Edie. She sounded worried. If Reaper forces were approaching, her concern was warranted. Let's hope we get to her before they do. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the Nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. Okay, so just like the last time we were looking for someone uh, when we were just looking for Garneau, we have a vague search area now and we could go there, but there is also like half a dozen systems in there, so we can also try to narrow it down and hey, let's, let's narrow it down. 
What is life for, if not down-narrowing? Can you identify this, Edie? It originates with a pre-spaceflight culture, but there are none recorded in the Pylos Nebula. So, not helpful then. Great. Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the Project Requisitions Locker. Okay. Uh, Follow-up question, Edie. Where is the Project Requ... Edie, where is the Project Requisitions Locker? It's got to be around here somewhere. So Project Basilisk was led by Garneau on the Kirkwall. Project Scarab was led by Anne Bryson on the MSV Icarus. So if we can, like, probably find places where this ship was? Anne Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Can you track its movements? Close to the sun. No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian comm buoys. But we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. It's made out of wax, mostly. There are specifications for several ships here. We need to find the Icarus. Which ship am I looking for again? The Icarus. Aha! The Icarus. The Icarus. Here we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. So they jumped to the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system? Yes. Otherwise, they would have chartered a less expensive ship. Okay, we can rule out the relay system. That's something. So as you can see, we're adding, uh, adding filters to our search as we go in. Maybe the Project Requisitions Locker is in here somewhere? Aha! The locker is secure. We must locate an access card to open it. Of course. What about criminal activity in the Pylos Nebula? Because the area is part of the Attican Traverse, criminal reports are unreliable at best. Hated how hard it was to know what filter did what. Yeah, it's it's a little... Like, this interface here is a little... iffy. It's not, you know, it's not perfect. It, once you've got it narrowed down to, to this system, I mean, it, it's hard to go wrong, because worst case scenario, you just go into, you know, four different star systems, oh no. But... Yeah, this part, I don't know. It, it, it could have been implemented a little bit better, I think. Bryson's assistant Hadley. Do we have an update on his status? He is in a vegetative state. The doctors believe it is permanent. Oh. But the miners recovered when the artifact was destroyed. Hadley lost consciousness when he attempted to answer our questions about Leviathan. It may have been a deliberate attempt to silence him permanently. Well, that's unfortunate. Access card for the requisitions locker? Yes. Hey, According to records, it was last used by Anne Bryson to obtain equipment for Project Scarab. Let's see what Anne Bryson requisitioned for Project Scarab. Didn't need an environmental suit. I'll just, I'll just take this person's Omniblade. It's mine now. Water recycling equipment. Based on what Anne Bryson did or did not requisition, the dig site was arid but habitable. Get me a filter for systems with compatible planets. Okay. So now we've got a couple of filters in here to help narrow down where in the system is Carmen San Diego. I mean, Dr. Annie Bryson. Which kind of fits if you change the woman's name from Anne to Annie like a jerk. Anyway, uh, let, let's filter based on uh, where that ship could have gone. Based on the search data, it is one of these two systems. Mm -hmm. And which of those systems has a habitable-ish habitable planets? Based on the data, only one system remains a viable possibility. Good. Let's go get Anne Bryson. And he's pretty qualified. We try not to abbreviate. I, 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 I do, we do not need a community jokes drop. We do not need a community jokes drop. 
we might need an I understood that reference drop, but we'll see. So yeah, if you didn't narrow down the searches, then you would have had to poke around in each of these systems and then inevitably wind up in the furthest one because that's just how it works here. Oh, is it this planet? I found something. I just kind of wrote that planet off as a Venus type, but okay. Let's go to Namakli. All right, Edie has been so damn helpful that she's coming along. And you know what? Th this is a dig site. Let's bring someone who's comfortable on dig sites. Liara can come too. We have reports of an attack at this excavation site. I'm sorry, what? Right, Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. Mm -hmm. Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Apparently this dig site is under attack. The more we know. Also, I like the... Uh, I, I, I really like the, the structure of these missions. The game... Like other DLCs, the game puts them off in their own world. And it's like, once you start this, you're done. You're not doing anything else until this is over. The Omega DLC, you go to it and then you don't come back until you're done with it. The Citadel DLC, you go to it and then you don't come back until you're done with the main plot of it. And then there's a jumping off point and then there's the party and we'll get to that. But with the Leviathan DLC, it's like the game the game knows that just through the course of the main plot, you're going to be weaving in and out of the Citadel so many times that, you know, a first-time player who has all the DLC or just someone who wants to maximize their efficiency and not dedicate themselves to, to focusing on one DLC chunk, you can just start the Leviathan DLC when you're at the Citadel. And then when you're out and about in the universe, oh, let's go let's go to that dig site and get Garneau. And then the next time you're at the Citadel, it's like, well, I'm already here at the Citadel. I might as well advance the Leviathan DLC. So they build the missions that way. And then in the missions, they build those little dialogue triggers that are like, wait, what are we doing here? Why are we here? So that's cool. Leviathan DLC, good DLC. Mass Effect 3, good game. Mass Effect as a series, as a, as a general concept, is, is cool and is good. Yes, the attack means the Reapers are one step ahead of us. We need to pick up the pace. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifact she uncovered may have caused additional complications. Ruh -ruh. Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. By additional complications, do you mean that she's been brainwashed by Leviathan? Because it's typically what it means. We have hostiles! Oh, great. Take us in! Commander, on the landing platform! That's her! Okay, let's get... Damn it! Oh, hi. Tracking multiple bogeys! Get us over there! Negative, it's too hot! Heading to lower platform, hang on! There, go! Jump! Well, Steve's dead. <laughs> We can't stay here, Shepard. Rip Steve, it's been fun. All right, uh, let's have you turn on your cryo ammo, you turn on your warp ammo, and everybody else go. This platform won't remain stable for long. Move, she's somewhere above us. Hello? Is anyone there? I'm coming down. No, stay where you are. This is Commander Shepard of the Alliance Navy. It's too dangerous. We'll come to you. Oh, boy. Yes, okay. You should take the elevator up on the far side. Copy that. We're on our way. Great. This is fine. It's fine. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> oh, boy. <clears throat> They're here. <clears throat> <clears throat> okay, Mass Effect levels never really feel like platforming Commander, challenges. They're swarming everywhere up 
up here. Can you find a place to hide? I'll try. This level Get kind there. of feels Stay like a platforming put. challenge. Oh, hi. Well, you can die. Yeah, yeah, you can die too. You over there, you're also going to die. I am the one who will make you die. If I uh, lash you. Yeah. You, you just die from having been lashed. Good work. High velocity barrel for the SMGs I don't use. That's good. Uh, let's reactivate the cryo ammo that I'm not using. Watch out! We're not going that way! Oh boy. Look for another path! Okay. Uh, look for another path. Sure. Oh. Oh, hi. Huh. Wait. What if we... Go up here, and then... Oh, hi, husks! <laughs> Goog Shepard looks very ranger-like today. Like Power Ranger? You saying you saying go go Power Rangers, Goog Shepard? Looks like a bridge over there. Controls are broken. Someone try to fix it. Right away, Commander. The wires have sustained damage. I'll need a moment for repairs. You're a machine. Oh look, husks. They are a turnaround. There are husks. The bridge has been repaired. Raising it now. <laughs> Do what? Doing it now. We don't like banshees. We're not fans of banshees. Hold on. Let, let, let's try the the new stupid shotgun. What if I charge and then shotgun? Oh, that's promising. The bridge is. Far. Hooray. Ranger Rick Shepard. Okay, okay, fine. You're just being a jerk. I got it. Very funny. Shepard, can we kill those husks? No? Alright, fine. Down we go. This way. Yeah. Hi there. Yep, no, you can get you can get lashed. You can get you. Oh, oh, oh! You, you, yeah, no. You don't like being lashed. I don't blame you. I wouldn't like being lashed either. But um, yeah, you don't care for it. All right, how do we uh, how do we up? Is this how we up? I think this is how we up. Elevator spotted, Shepard. Got it. And the elevator's blocked. Is there another way up? Copy that. Super. Hey, look, a mass pulse recoil system for the SMGs I never use. Okay. Show how do we... Aha. We hoop. And then we hop. Yep, just like More that. More enemies ahead. Great. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy, okay, we're fine. We're okay, we're okay. Everybody cool. You got shattered. <gasps> Listen, it's Christmas. It's Christmas. Don't say she looks like a watermelon. You're all jerks. <clears throat> Shepard, you fuck. <sighs> why, why do any of you exist? Oh, Ellie, God's. Edie, why are you? Why is your back to take cover, please? Doing it now. Let's, let's focus on <clears throat> Let's... Yes! You get 
perked over the ledge like you're a goon in Arkham Asylum. And I'm only saying that because I've been playing a lot of Arkham Asylum lately. Good game. <sighs> Whee! <laughs> 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 oh, Lash is a good power. Lash is fun. All right, you're dead. You ah! little You're dead too. I don't care about you. The alliance does not pay me enough to care about you. You already get up. Everybody's dead. All right, up we get. Oh, hi. You remember that whole everybody's dead thing? Well, maybe now it's true. We're blocked. Find another way. Yara, can you please get up? Okay. Up. And over. And up. And hoop. Oh, hi. Whee! Oh, you're quite dead. Oh, hi, Liara! Nice of you to show up. Could have sworn she was, you know, dead halfway across the map. Fucking <laughs> those guys. That's the technical term for those Anne, enemies. you still there? Fucking We're those guys. Hopkins is wounded. Are you close? Who's Hopkins? We're moving as fast as we can. Hang to in about there. Hopkins? Oh, fuck me, that's a brute. Okay, alright, listen. No, don't, don't, don't claw me. Don't. Shepard, would you please charge the, oh boy, oh boy, okay. Let, let's go first aid. Yeah, would heal, Shepard, heal thyself. Heal thy, oh boy, oh, oh, you need to, okay, I need to be not here. Okay, all right, this is bad. This, okay, here we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. Oh, boy. That platform's coming down. Sound mini game is the go most around. fun mini game in Mass Effect 3. We all die at 90 per I, Listen, if, if that's no, what 10%. No, Boyles, stay down. Oh, God. Oh, no, poor dead What's Boyles. happening? Kirkwood and Boyles tried to run for it. The Reapers got him. Oh, no. Don't move until we get there. Oh, no, not Kirkwood, too. I had never heard of any of these people, but now they're all dead. Oh, there's nobody there. Oh, good, somebody there. All right, this Geth Plasma Shotgun. That's almost English. Geth Plasma Shotgun, kind of. <laughs> Okay, for a second I thought that this thing was just being yanked around by the singularity, and that ruled. But, um, no. No, it's just there being scary. Hi, come here. Thank you. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. We're continuing forward. Nobody's gonna die. Except for Reapers. Have you considered a sniper rifle? I mean... I do have this. <clears throat> da, 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 da. Come on. And yes, Kath, I know what you're saying, that that's not actually a sniper rifle, but uh, consider that I don't care. And also, I have incinerate. Thank you, Evie. It has a scope. That makes it a... Come on now. I'm just going to move with the swarmers. That's going to go fine. D didn't actually go fine. Stunning. Crap. Okay, would, would literally anyone like to do anything helpful, please? No, don't put a grenade next to my... Oh, don't die. Oh, good, I didn't die. Jeez. Hey, look, an Omniblade I'm never going to use for the assault rifle. All right, are we good? No, probably not. Hey, look, cave art. Anything the with the scope is a sniper rifle. Get to it. 
It's also true in Fallout New Vegas that anything with a scope that isn't a sniper rifle is bad. So, uh, aha, I go this way. Wait, isn't this where I just was? Like five minutes ago? No, it's a different place. Good. I'll salvage 5,000 credits worth of data. And get 100 XP for touching a med kit. Fantastic. Elevator's online. We're coming up. Please hurry. I think Hopkins is dead. Oh no, not Hopkins. Well, that's a corpse. He tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? They're dead. I'm sorry. They didn't make it. Doctor, I need you to come with me. Where do you think okay. they are? Yes, of course. I uh, was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Shepard, look. Mm-hmm. Oh. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Mm-hmm. Clearly a reaper, but acting alone. Not like any Reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact. Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. You know, you're awfully calm for a lady who's, you know, 70 feet away from death. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people. Their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! Oh. Oh, bad. Oh, it's supercharged marauders. They've activated it somehow. I've never managed anything. Doctor? Damn. They've learned too well. The darkness must not be breached. Oh, Jesus. Shepard! Take it out! Got it! Wait, you can just you okay? shoot those things? Cortez, we have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle? You run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. It's for the best that Hopkins didn't live to see this. He, he cared very deeply for weird glowing things. <gasps> to see one blown up like that would have been terribly traumatic for him. It's, it's best that You need to get rid of that harvester. Let we'll us bring honor down. his memory by never speaking to him. Oh, God, fuck. Okay, all right. Edie, Doing just, it now. Just, just shoot the... Everybody shoot the harvester, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. <clears throat> everybody shoot the harvester, except Shepard, who will shoot the... Everybody else. <clears throat> oh, that's not the... That's not the button I meant to hit. <clears throat> that's the button I meant to hit. Thank you, Shepard. Okay. Maybe, um, maybe, maybe have health now. There we go. Good idea. Okay, can you not, like, fire an endless wave of bombarding <clears throat> explosions at my personal face? I like my face. All things being equal, I would rather keep it than lose it. <clears throat> oh, oh, that's gonna explode and I'm gonna die. <clears throat> yep. Oh, nope. Not yet. Not yet. Good. 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 It's fine. It's fine. Um. Hmm. That sure seems like a lot of, uh... Alright, let's try the incendiary ammo. Do -do -do. And also the shoot the fuck out of the harvester. Oh my god, is it dead? Cortez, get in here! Cool! Copy that, Commander! I will rendezvous with Cortez, with Cortez in a moment. I have a <laughs> cannibals to charge. 
Okay, that's a weird thing. Shuttle ready for did. evac, Commander. We copy that. Everybody, let's go. All right, let's get out of here. Everybody, run. You okay? Yeah, Commander. I I think so. I blacked out. Tends to happen. Leviathan took control of you. We cut the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself? That's incredible. The Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first, Doctor. I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers, never went back to dark space, like a rogue or even a defector. And did you I not have hear to call my father. He'll want to know. And did you Anne, not hear about the... You need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. Sorry. Yeah. He's... What? Dead? He can't be dead. I'm a, I'm afraid I've got some bad news, Anne. Glorious. We met with him, hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine, the next. He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to yeah, find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Anne? I... I, I want to see his office. Bad idea, but okay. We'll arrange for transportation to meet you there. Sure. Sure, fine. Great. Awesome. Yeah, Admiral Anderson has been available for a month now. And he never has anything to say. He's just like, hi, Shepard. Do you have questions for me? Ah. It's my Keith David impression. It's very bad. It's getting worse by the day. But uh, what is not getting worse by the day is the Leviathan DLC. That is going to be the end of this episode. Thank you all for watching. We will be back to the Citadel next time with more. Until then, everybody take care. Goodbye.